in the difficult phase is the most important phase. Mm -hmm. That is where your faith will be birthed. Mm -hmm. That's where you will begin to st grow a stronger bond. Mm. Like me, there is a bond we have with my husband that I'm sure no man can break. You know mm. why? Because we've had phases where we had to go through a season of building that bond. Mm. And those seasons, sometimes, most of them are not desirable. Mm. You see? But you have to reach a point whereby you know marriage is bigger than both of you. Wow. Marriage is bigger than your weaknesses. Marriage is bigger than even your self ambitions mm. you have to stop your ambition and say wait a, wait a minute darling this is marriage we're handling mm. here you could be having a challenge i could be having a challenge how mm. do we move forward oh yes and that thing can only come from a point of wholeness mm. Thank you for tuning in again for the Naked and Not Ashamed show. If you are new on the show, this is a show that inspires family positively through different topics. We are just happy that you are tuning in and we welcome you to today's topic which is different seasons of marriage. Ma, mm. this is a very hot topic and I believe that every one of us yes. will pick something that can relate with the stage that you are in mm. and if you have surpassed that stage then we thank God for you. Mm. But I want to say that marriage has no script, mm. there is no book, there is no manual, mm -hmm. uh, you need a lot of knowledge, a lot of uh, mentorship, a lot of uh, being intentional Mm. to gather knowledge so that you can be able to have the the, the kind the kind of marriage that God intended yeah. but the Word of God gives us a framework of mm. what we're supposed to do and I believe that uh, to, today we are going to talk about the seasons in marriage and by the end of this show your life will be edified your marriage will also have changed so that you don't judge yourself so harshly depending with the stage that you are in that you should know that better things are ahead and so I'm so happy for this topic and I believe that we are going to learn a lot yes my heart is open just like how life is we have seasons of ups and downs dry seasons and wet seasons and I know even our marriages go through them so we want to know which stage is your marriage and which season are you going to and most of us we are defined by these seasons which should not be the issues isn't you? exactly because a season just comes and goes no season is always permanent mm -hmm. yeah that's what I thought yeah and uh, the word of God also says very clearly mm -hmm. that as long as the heavens and the earth remain mm -hmm. there will be seed time and harvest <laughs> time <laughs> and I believe also in marriage mm -hmm. it is the same way mm -hmm. it's important to be able to understand mm -hmm. where am I um, in my family mm -hmm. which season are we operating in mm -hmm. so that mm -hmm. we don't behave like people who are in 20 mm -hmm. And we are in fifth floor <laughs> uh, already, mm -hmm. and we should have adjusted yeah. to yeah. fifth floor. Mm -hmm. And you see, up on the table, Kibizana, what were 19, 20, 22, who are going to be a mioto. Now we're going to engineer Mazeka. Yeah, it's important to understand mm. where you are mm. so that you're able to handle your partner yeah. in the best way possible. Mm. You are able to prepare them mm. um, yes. so that they are able to enjoy the whole journey. Mm. And by the end of the day, mm. both of you enjoy. Mm -hmm. But it's so unfortunate because you realize mm. that um, I don't know why men don't think that one day I mean, they'll get old. They behave as if, you know, they are always in, in energetic. energetic and all that. Mm. It's important to understand that life comes, things change. Mm -hmm. And when things change, mm -hmm. it's important to know how do you amp your game? Mm. How do you move to the next level? So that by the end of the day, you don't start blaming your partner. Mm. At Niwewe. Eh? I'm an Mimi. Mm. Yeah. Instead of brain game, mm. why can't you look for a solution? Mm -hmm. Why can't you look for what can benefit both of you? Yeah. So I think it's important to understand that yeah. marriages have got seasons. Yeah, mm -hmm. just yeah. like as mm. Dad is saying, mm -hmm. marriage has season, seasons. If you look at your partner, how you began with them, they have gone through a lot of so many stages of growth, painful growth, good growth they have become better people if they oh, are yes. proactive. Mm. Right, ma'am? Yes. Yeah, and that tells us that marriage 
as you prolong, as you continue to grow together, there is also a shift of mindset. Mm. Because you find why most of the most of us get it get it hard to adjust to different seasons and understand timing and seasons is because we are still using the we are stuck in the previous mindset. Oh yes. In the growth mindset, you had a different mi mind, mental frame. The woman who was married 24 years and the woman you are seeing now is a totally different woman. That means mm -hmm. there have been a lot of growth, a lot yes. of adjustment, adjustment and mm -hmm. support from my partner as well. So, mm -hmm. the, mom, as you bring up this, the faces, yes. we need to see also the aspects of mental paradigms, the growth faces, yes. mental changes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Wow, that's very important because one of the stages that uh, is very paramount is the dream stage. Yeah. In this stage, it is before marriage, yeah. whereby there's a lot of weakness, uh, Salano. <laughs> <laughs> you go for a date with someone and you want to behave Angel Agnes, you want to <laughs> behave Angel Gabriel. Yeah. You know, you want to, to, to put your foot forward, you know, yeah. to just look a very good, a, a, a wife material and mm -hmm. a husband material. Yeah. And you find there are people who are able to fake it, mm -hmm. both of you until you get into marriage. Mm -hmm. So when you are in marriage, you still want the same picture you saw when you are dating and when you are courting. Yeah. And this person was not so. Mm -hmm. They were actually pretending for that time when they met you. Mm -hmm. And now that Mumengi uh, Zana kwa box, now everybody begins now to manifest their true colors. Mm -hmm. And I think that's where now conflict commotion comes in mm. because I, I expected that little timid girl mm. to continue mm. without answering me and now she's here questioning me over things that have never been questioned even by your mother or your father mm. and so dream stage has had so many people getting you know dilemmas and mm. getting confused and and it, it, it makes people live a life that is not real mm -hmm. but I came to tell us that if for you are going to enjoy your marriage you have to delete the dream the dream, the dream, the dream and the husband and the dream wife mm -hmm. and deal now with reality. Yeah. Uh -huh. You get that. Mm -hmm. eh? Because if you keep dreaming, it is no longer a dream. Mm -hmm. It is now a reality. You're okay. in the same house. Yeah. You have now begun the life of marriage. And so we need to delete that and deal with the reality. The reality is my wife suffers with anger. My husband also has anger. This man uh, has friends mm -hmm. uh, that he cannot stop or uh, he cannot even be able to do away with them, he must go see, you know, there are those realities. Mm -hmm. My husband does not shower, he doesn't like showering, <laughs> now you have to cope up with that. <laughs> you know, this person has all these negatives and these positives. So I think the best way for us to be able to move on in marriage mm -hmm. is to make sure that we don't live in the dream. Mm -hmm. And so many people have, have, have lived in the dream, as Pastor Monene has said, you know, having that mind of a dream husband and a dream wife. Mm -hmm. So you find there's always a conflict in your mind because the dream wife and the real wife are not the same. Mm -hmm. The dream husband and the dream and the real wife is not the same. Mm -hmm. So that conflict can continue for a very long time. Mm -hmm. And we begin to tell each other, that you are not meant for me. I think you are not meant, you are not compatible. Mm -hmm. But it's because there's something that needs to happen immediately after we marry. We marry. Mm -hmm. Dreams must cease. Be deleted. We, yeah, be deleted. Mm -hmm. Let's deal now with reality. Yes. The, the feeling of love ends. The feeling of love ends, ends completely. So you have to deal with the reality. Mm -hmm. Emotions of love end. Yes. Yeah. So you will have to, 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 to like and, and learn to live with the person you are you are married to, understand them and grow into a new love now. Wow, that I, one, I that love was, that. That's yes. a very strong point, yes. uh, viewers. Because the feeling of love, the reason why you felt so much attracted to each other, that was uh, that feeling was supposed to bring you together to be a husband and a wife. Mm -hmm. Immediately you marry that feeling just disappears yeah. in the air. Mm -hmm. So what makes marriage now work from there is commitment, mm -hmm. not commitment. feelings, yes. Mm -hmm. Marriage can never be a feeling because no. there are times you feel sad, there are times you feel happy, mm -hmm. you know, there are times you feel this. Mm -hmm. So you can't base your marriage again on feelings. Mm -hmm. You have now to base it on the truth and commitment to each other. Mm -hmm. That I'm married to you despite all your weakness and your strength, mm -hmm. I'm going to stay with you. Because we say it for good, for us, mm -hmm. for yeah. richer, for poorer, mm -hmm. you know, in sickness, out of sickness, so now the vows begin to to, to you leave the vows the vows you leave the vows yeah. and you allow the vows now to lead you but the feeling of love completely God. dies God yeah. dies completely and you can't live on that feeling all throughout yeah yes I also I also want to think that you find that during this dream stage yes some dream stage always 
uh, come truth comes during the wedding night yes because or the morning after the wedding because you okay. see you've always seen this lady in makeups yeah, yeah. she's always yeah. looking like a doll yeah. Yeah. very cute <laughs> and then after wedding that i'm under kuwago you're like ametoa makeup ametoa wig kwanza akatoa <laughs> makeup <laughs> now you're like a fellow <laughs> man or who akatoa men akatoa men <laughs> so it is so oh fake goodness. and then you find that you 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 find this for during the wedding <laughs> and you ask the guy why do you love this lady wow this girl is so humble uh -huh. she's so god fearing uh -huh. this is a face that was just being displayed for you to get market her value. to market value yeah so so this is just a stage <laughs> i love that market yeah. value market value you know to, to, yeah, to, to improve to, to increase her market value yeah. so she, she will never show any signs of disrespect to you hamuta kosana ta kidogo you go out she doesn't want to finish one mandazi because yeah. you will think she's a glutton yeah. she just <laughs> takes half a small so that i mean skulangi sana you are like wow this is a very economical wife hata sita kwani spend sana and then maybe you are like you, you, you at, at, even even the guy you find the guy muko kwa date you accidentally knock the table and the food goes down ina mwa like atasema don't worry i'll pay for another one why is the letter ingine so anaumia lakini hawezi tonje because he's still in the face of dream he want to be that dream man and then you are like during the wedding you're like hey, my salano doesn't even shout even if i make a mistake he's always so calm wait wait go to the side yeah so it's just a face as mommy is saying we should stop dreaming from that yes. because after wedding night now the real thing are going to start coming up it will, yeah, yeah sometimes maybe even go a few months in wed after wedding in oh, marriage yes. when asanga i have best muko honeymoon best marriage so far best my husband sweet and mutasema tu but sometimes you know okay uje balonga na imba president washu bana za nipiga kofi pia real real colors begin coming in you yes. said you are a pastor and you are shouting at me you know utajua ujui you see my friend mm. there's something i'm closer trying to observe mm in couples mm -hmm. when i married sue mm -hmm. there is what attracted me to her mm -hmm. uh, you know I, I saw a very social girl mm -hmm. a very outgoing person mm -hmm. you know mm -hmm. i looked and i said wow that is the kind of a woman mm -hmm. i would wish mm -hmm. to marry and to have mm -hmm. and then mm -hmm. for her when she saw me she saw a very um, polite girl, mm -hmm. a very quiet gentleman, mm -hmm. someone who loves reasoning and uh, following uh, things that are happening. Mm -hmm. But then when we come in marriage, mm -hmm. remember, I married her because she was very outgoing. Mm -hmm. She was very social. Mm -hmm. She becomes social with everybody. <laughs> <laughs> you get it. Mm -hmm. Now when we go out for meetings, mm. she's talking for three hours. With other people and I want we go home. Mm. You get it. Mm. Yes. When we finish a meeting, mm. she doesn't want to go home. Mm -hmm. She still wants to take another two more hours. With the people. With the people. Because she's a social being. Because she's a social being. being. And then I wonder. Where does this woman come from? Uh -huh. Does she know time is going? Yes. Does she then understand? Have another commitment. I have another commitment. Mm -hmm. Remember, I married her mm -hmm. because yes. I loved the way she was outgoing. Mm -hmm. The way she was social. Mm -hmm. Now, the reason why I married her now becomes a pain. A pain. A pain in my marriage. Oh yes. Uh, yeah. It becomes now the stubborn block. Mm -hmm. And if you look at many people, mm -hmm. what they saw. And what they loved today has become <laughs> the bone of contention. The thorn in the flesh. The thorn in the flesh. The thorn in the flesh. In the flesh. Yes. Mm -hmm. She married me because I was a gentleman. Mm -hmm. I was not very talkative. Mm -hmm. I, I knew how to carry myself. Mm -hmm. And then when we come in marriage, mm -hmm. I continue to keep quiet. <laughs> <laughs> And she wants someone to talk and to. And she wants someone she can talk, talk to. to. Mm. And she gets, you know, offended by that. And that's what you're talking about. You know, the dream, what you had. Mm. The dream wow. wife. Mm. The dream husband. Yeah. Now you must run now mm. to derate that. 
and learn to live with the reality. This is who Monene is. Mm -hmm. This is who Sue is. Mm -hmm. The red, what I thought and what I had seen, <laughs> and now live with the reality. Mm -hmm. Then maybe just uh, <laughs> yes. as, as we continue with that, uh, uh, in the spirit of understanding the person, now yeah. reality, Yes. realization stage yes this is where you realize that um really looked back been self-reflecting from yes. the time since we began with my lovely husband here mm -hmm. now you will realize as a couple those very very tough issues that you guys fought over Mm -hmm. were the very issues you needed to mm -hmm. grow to the next stage. Oh yes. Have you ever realized that, oh, that yes. when you argue over an issue, you argue as long as both of you are, are ready to find a solution. These are the issues you actually needed to argue over them mm -hmm. or even fight over them. Yes. So, but what we do nowadays, we run away. We say, ah, what's your kind of but mm -hmm. you should sit down and fight. Yes. Fight until you come to understanding. Fighting doesn't have to be physical. Mm -hmm. It means you bringing your point, he's bringing your point, and you find a, a common ground. Mm -hmm. This is his personality. I yes. hate his personality. But also, he can't do anything about the personality. Yes. So there must be a balance. Wow. Mm -hmm. And that is also the stage yeah. whereby you keep on comparing uh, your partner, mm. your love, mm. with other people. Yes. Oh, yes. When you don't do away with the dream. Mm -hmm. Oh yes, partner. When you don't delete. When you don't delete. So, so can, 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 we, can we say that if you find that you are still being compared to 20 years in marriage, it mm. means the partner is still in dream stage. Uh -huh. yeah. Yes. You can uh -huh. live in dream stage all the days of mm. your life. It's important. Uh -huh. Any stage that we are going to talk about, mm. you, can, you can actually get stuck in it mm. because you don't know what to do. And that comes when now you have not invested yourself in knowledge. Mm. Exposure is also very important. Mm. And also the way uh, Beryl is saying, mm. realizing that what I saw is not what my partner is. Mm. How can I adjust to accommodate them in my life yeah, yeah. now that they are this? Mm. You, you accept the new reality. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, you stop now having the dream, the dream, the dream marriage, mm. the dream husband, the dream wife. Mm. And I think that's where the problem comes in because you can live in that. And that's why you find, as you're saying, mm -hmm. there's a lot of comparison. Mm -hmm. You're not like this, you're not like so and so. You're not like, because mm -hmm. you are still, you, you still have the mindset of who your wife should be and your husband should be, mm -hmm. and they are not becoming. Mm -hmm. And so it frustrates you as a person so much. Yeah. So I think what Pastor Morena has given us is the antidote mm -hmm. about the dream stage. Mm -hmm. Many things that you wished you would make the bed will be very clean, will cook for you breakfast and bring it in the bedroom. Those are not reality. Not happening. You get a lot happening. <laughs> You know, will wake up, meet me at the gate, hug me with a flower. With a flower, he then you get the point. And even he forgets your birthday sometimes. Sometimes they, they forget the anniversary. Yeah. So now you have to deal with reality because mm -hmm. y y there's not that perfect ideal wife and husband. Mm -hmm. Every one of us you know have have some weaknesses mm -hmm. and you can't know someone until you stay with them yes. under the same roof mm -hmm. you know 365 days wow. that's when you're able to know ah it is not what i thought yeah. and i think that's where now uh the the the, the hearts of men mm -hmm. the hearts of women who are married begins to coil mm -hmm. you feel frustrated you feel like you made the, the wrong choice mm -hmm. you feel like you are cheated you begin to remember mm -hmm. the other boyfriends you begin to remember you are classmate yeah. who was eyeing on you, mm -hmm. you the someone you be, mm. all these things begin now to come and you, you want i wish i married irene yeah. i wish i married eunice i wish i was married by one watch i think i was married by 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 walter mm. at the same time these people also have their own weaknesses mm. so and then you see mm -hmm. as you look at the irene you are eyeing yes and her husband you still you, you you see that they're doing well yeah but you don't know what is in that marriage yes. then you say I, yeah. I, I would have been down in that space yes in that place but now this guy is frustrating me yes. that side always looks better than what you mm. are having mm. and i also tend to think that uh, what is affecting our marriages mostly it's because we have fail to differentiate between marriage being a process and mm -hmm. wedding being an event. Yes. So you find that most of our energy, mm -hmm. we, we focus on the dream on the, wedding. On the day. On the day. Mm -hmm. yes. And I would wow. say this, you'll find that wow. before you go to a wedding, mm -hmm. you have a team of people who will help you. Mm -hmm. People will say, Minta kupatia gari, Mimi mm -hmm. Minta kupatia, deco for free, Mimi mm -hmm. Nikona Kata Ring Team, Minta Kungozia Bay, Minta yes. Kuleteke. So people are there to support you. And then all your energy, 99% of your time, is focused on the wedding. On the wedding day. And then, 
When that wedding comes, you only discuss only a one-day event, and then it goes away. Then you come to reality. You and never thought about your everybody marriage. Everybody else disappears. Everybody disappears. Mm -hmm. Now you are in marriage. There's no one who is there to offer you free counseling service. There's no one who is off there to offer you free money in your marriage. Yes. You are now the two of you. All those people who are giving you free cars, they are no longer there. Mm -hmm. So Lagundua, now I'm here alone, and now the reality downs on you. In fact, there are so many marriages that are really struggling because they have never known that this is not a stage to stay. Mm. It is a stage to get into the marriage, and get, uh, get the reality, note it down, mm. and then immediately delete, yeah. completely erase, mm. uh, blot it out. Ah. I don't know which other word we can use. Uh, replace. Know, uh, replace. Uh -huh. Shift, delete. Shift, shift uh -huh. and delete. Mm. You know which other word very. You uh -huh. know you erase, uh, you delete, yes. you do Forget. away with. You, uh -huh. You blot out, you yeah. forget, yes. you have to do all those things yes. so that now you deal with the real person mm. and accept now this person with their strength and their weakness. Yeah. Mm. And now you don't major so much on the weakness, mm. you major on their strength mm -hmm. and vice versa also. Yeah. The other spouse also must major with the strength of your partner mm. and don't major with your weakness because when you start majoring with your weakness, mm. you begin now to compare them with someone else and they can never be anybody else. Yeah. So that dream stage, many people are in it. It has they caused fail. a lot of pain. Mm. It has caused a lot of frustration in marriage. Mm. And someone still think there is a better wife more than uh, the, my, wife. my wife and mm. my husband. Mm. But that thing is not true. It's just in your mind. Mm. But in reality, even if you married who, you will still find Even if support. it was the other person even if it was the that other person. you married. Yes. yes. It's only that now we have learned to cope. Mm. There are people who admire me mm -hmm. right now, Pastor yes. Mulele, but they don't <laughs> like know the cost, mother, the, uh -huh. the, the, the cost you paid. The cost, the cost you paid to to teach to me the word, be. you know, to remove anger, mm. to teach me how to speak, Manorism. you know, mannerisms. Yeah. Yeah. You get that of a pastor's wife. But now, right now, everybody <laughs> would want to be associated with Pastor Sue, mm. but they don't know the work that this man did behind uh -huh. the scene. Yeah. And he never, you know, he never even exposed me to his relatives, his friends. Mm -hmm. He would go gather knowledge, come back and try to see whether it will work. Mm. If it doesn't work, he goes and think for another mm. invention mm. until I was able to align align my life now with him. Mm. And so dream stage is yeah. a stage that so many has brought a lot of confusion. Mm. Yeah, yes. so also in the dream stage, mm -hmm. one thing I can, I can highlight that yes. I realized, you will come to it is also a discovery stage. Mm -hmm. it's, it's the stage where you, rea you begin to self-realize Yani you begin to self discover you self discovery and also the more you discover yourself the more you discover your partner the more you discover your identity your identity and your wholeness you become mm. whole you begin to discover your partner's weaknesses and challenges oh, yes. and you know the, the only thing that can help us is uh, when you allow the person there is something you once said mm. allow them to be Allow if, them if, to be. if marriage is operating from a point of authenticity, mm. where your partner doesn't have to hide from you because they are struggling, mm. where your partner doesn't have to package themselves to look in a certain way, they will be vulnerable enough and you will be able to grow out of the space. Very true. So one of the most powerful forces after love, mm. authenticity. Mm. When you are, what you are saying, what you are feeling, and what you are doing correlates mm -hmm. where they align mm -hmm. and then it corresponds mm -hmm. you you at you are you are your partner will mirror your life yes because if you are a person who is rigid mm. stuck from a place you will keep demanding from your partner Very true. i never bargained for this i never bargained for this but you need to fill your cup mm. your partner because energies Everything is energy. Oh yes. The moment you raise your energy, your partner definitely will raise his. Very true. That's why me, I always say, if I discover a weakness in my place or mm. space, I say maybe there is something not working with me. Yes. Maybe I raise mine before wow. I go to confront the issue. Yes. So that 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 discovery stage, you'll discover a lot of weaknesses, a lot of discouragements. Mm. But you need that's the time for you to grow, mm. not to run. Mm. Yes. I also think that there's a book that you, I was reading sometimes, and they were saying that most of the time we always focus on on them. Weakness. <laughs> when we are quarreling, I begin with you, you, you. Yes. But sometimes you should always start with I. Yeah. So I was thinking, mm. can we do it this way? Mm. Or I, I think I, I was wrong. Yeah. Yes, I think I, I was I I. But you can say that we were talking last. You, Nini, you. When you all talk about you, is always the good part. Mm. Me, I always try. Me, I always, but you, so that in this marriage, this, this person is always the bad guy, yes, and you're always the, the good villain. guy, <laughs> and even that guy is always seeing as the good yeah. guy, and you're always the, the bad guy mm. until you begin focusing on I sure. and on myself, then we'll not be going anywhere. That's very true because, mm. uh, you know, the Adamic nature mm. is very selfish, mm. 
Mm -hmm. uh, it is me, myself, and I. Personally. And that's why you find not mm -hmm. many people will accept a mistake. Mm -hmm. And th that brings a, a, a point whereby it becomes difficult even for a husband to correct the wife mm -hmm. and the wife to correct the husband. Mm -hmm. Because it seems like you are focusing on my weakness, mm -hmm. you're not focusing uh, on your weakness. Yeah. And that's why you find most of the couples, uh, they are not able to correct one another freely. Mm -hmm. Because anytime you bring uh, that that element of my wife, my husband, there's this thing I was thinking you need to adjust, mm -hmm. it brings such a tension. Mm -hmm. And they begin to tell you, hey, unaanza kuniambia, wewe, wewe, una weakness, wewe kumbukia ta another day, and he, they begin to remind you about your past. Mm -hmm. And so they put fear in you, and you're like, ah, watch a kai video, anata, mm -hmm. anataka. Mm -hmm. So you find that weakness that was supposed to be corrected by your wife and by your husband mm -hmm. escalates until it is seen at the place of work, mm -hmm. it is seen in the church, yeah. and every person who meets you knows that you have a problem. Mm -hmm. But this problem would have been solved, or this weakness would have been solved by your partner, mm. uh, the way Barry has said, if you allowed yourself to be vulnerable right, yeah. and allowed the, the other person to come in because you can't be perfect. You can't be at the mambo yako yote ni mzuri. There must be a weakness that you are in and that's why you, a, a husband and a wife must know that they have come together to complement each other. Mm -hmm. Complementation means there is what you are strong in and mm -hmm. me I'm weak mm -hmm. but we bring together synergy mm -hmm. so that we can make this marriage move. So that has really brought a lot of challenge. Ma'am, on and that the, thing of compliment, yeah, yes. you mm -hmm. see people always think that at we, we compliment each other so much yeah. because he loves movies, I love movies. I love Omena, he also loves Omena. Mm -hmm. he, that's not compliment. <laughs> yes. I think to compliment is whereby what I you don't opposite. like, you like it. That's the opposite. Now that's now we, we have like the yeah. we, we fit in. We fit whereby in. I don't like Omena yeah. and you love Managu, you begin teaching me how to love Managu and teach you how to love Omena. Then we meet yes, at a center. That then we, yeah. That's now compliment. Just like I had given an example, I struggled wow. with the spirit of anger. My husband didn't have it, mm. but he was able to win me to his side. Mm -hmm. You get that? So yeah. he was able to compliment mm. and teach me now to stand on my own and how to deal with the spirit of anger and showing me the side effect of all these things that have held for so many years before he came to marry me. Mm -hmm. So that is what we call complimentation. Mm -hmm. Like for example, I'm so talkative, my husband is not talkative. <laughs> At least we have someone who can listen, another one who is talking, so that there is no boredom in the house. Yeah. That is complimentation. Imagine all of you are Another silent. one makes the bed, another all one does not talkative. eat. All of you are talkative. Yeah. Another, another one makes the bed, another one does not make the bed. Mm -hmm. So if both of you know how to make bed, we'll be arguing, this body shit is going to be a but all if yeah. So yeah. that's why you find when, when one person is trying struggling with a with with one issue it mm. becomes very easy to to compliment to blend like me until mm. now i've never I, I have never understood why you always make beds in the morning mm -hmm. because you will come back on it in the evening why do we against <laughs> you you don't come and mpia there's nobody coming in that room to check it it's hidden place but her lazy my own she takes an all this effort you see now you will be coming back yeah, in the evening to go to i don't see the need of but here i decorate i wake a pillow wapi i don't to see the sense yeah hey, so hey. suppose i met a lady who was like me how will our bedroom be looking like <laughs> oh my goodness <laughs> you see what i'm talking yeah. about yeah, yeah, yeah. complimentation yeah. means mm. you are directly opposite, opposite. Yeah. of each other yeah, yeah. that's and those are the marriages that drive mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. you get the point eh? mm -hmm. but when both of you are strong in an area mm -hmm. you will never appreciate one another because mm -hmm. we are both strong yeah. you get that eh? yeah. that's why you find when you are extreme opposite of one another that marriage stays together mm -hmm. and you when you go to them you're like how do these people stay <laughs> <laughs> you get that. Yeah. Like I see my our marriage is, is opposite of each other. Mm -hmm. As we are extremely opposite of each other. Wow. And I think that's what makes us blend so well with Pastor Monene. Uh -huh. Because what is good in mm -hmm. me, I, I, ex I extremely struggle. score negative. You struggle to negative. Uh -huh. And what I'm strong in, mm -hmm. my husband is, is, is very weak in that. Mm -hmm. So it becomes very easy for us mm -hmm. to appreciate one another, yes. for us to accommodate each other, mm -hmm. because we know Mm. Uh, my husband knows my strength and I also know his strength mm. and now because of the years that we have gone there are things I can't do until I get his word mm -hmm. because his word is final I am I know in this area I'm not very good yeah. but when he comes he will just speak one word mm. and I'm able to my eyes are opened mm. to see something that was an opportunity that I would have lost and vice versa mm. so when we talk about complementation we are talking of things that are opposite each other but you people you have a ground mm. where you come together and you agree this is the way forward yeah. yes yeah. maybe mm. just to add to before mom mentions the phases of, of uh, yes. marriage yes. Mm. in the difficult phase is the most important phase mm -hmm. 
That is where your faith will be birthed. Mm -hmm. That's where you will begin to st grow a stronger bond. Mm. Like me, there is a bond we have with my husband that I'm sure no man can break. You mm. know why? Because we've had phases where we had to go through a season of building that bond. Mm. And those seasons, sometimes, most of them are not desirable. Mm. You see? But you have to reach a point whereby you know marriage is bigger than both of you. Wow. Mm. Marriage is bigger than your weaknesses. Marriage is bigger than even your self ambitions. Mm. You have to stop your ambition and say, wait a, wait a minute, darling, this is marriage we're handling mm. here. You could be having a challenge, I could be having a challenge. How mm. do we move forward? Oh, yes. And that thing can only come from a point of wholeness. Mm. If you are empty, you are drained, you are stressed, you will be anxious over everything, everybody, everybody coming to your space feeling mm. they are drained as well. Oh, yes. They go, you fight your relatives, you, you, you become a pain to your partner. Mm. But if you are a person who is full, your partner will find a way of growing along with you because marriage is definitely growth. Oh, yes. It is just growth. It's like when I say my, taking up your cross every day. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> taking up your cross. Eh? You are carrying oh, your, your cross. cross. Until your the cross end of every... life, oh, till wow. eternity. Mm. It's like Still salvation, eh? Yes. Yeah. This oh, is yes. your partner. This is your soulmate. Mm. You have to look at them even if you don't feel like loving them at the moment. Mm. And say, I don't have much love for this person. Yeah. But you know what? Marriage mm. is bigger than us. Mm. And the spirit oh, yes. man. Now you go to the spirit man. Mm. What, what does my spirit man have for our relationship at this time? Because mm. my mind is up off yes. i can't handle it this mentally mm. but you go to your spirit you find solutions wow we need god mm. in that face very true we need mm. books pro marriage mm. books. knowledge mm. we need positive friends mm. because if you have network of people who tell you ah you are in a difficult season you need po positive energy mm -hmm. yeah